Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to create a classic cat eye for New Year's Eve. So if you want to learn how I created this look, just keep on watching. I'm going to be going in with the Believe Beauty Concealer. This is very affordable if you're looking for something that's cheap. It's from 4 to $5, so I recommend it. And I'm going to be tapping this in with the sponge from InStylish. This sponge is really, really good, you guys. I'm going to link all of this down below if you guys are interested in purchasing it. I also have a discount code. Now I'm applying some tape. This is going to help my cat eye look really sharp. And now I'm going to be going in with my 3503 palette. And I'm going to be going in with the shade the OG and I'm going to be buffing this out on the outer corner. I'm using a fluffy brush from Morphe called the M441 and I'm just going to be applying this on that outer corner and slightly bringing it over to the center but not all the way. I'm going to show you a trick if you've never used tape before. Try to do your eyeshadow before your foundation because the, the tape is going to mess it up. So always do your eyes first when you're creating looks like this. So once this shade is nicely blended and it looks very smoky, we're going to be going in with the shade Domination. And I'm using a smaller fluffy brush called the M433, also by Morphe. And we're going to be applying this on the outer corner, but as you can see, we're applying this on the lid. We're not applying this above our crease. This is the area where we're going to be focusing on the most, okay? Next, I'm going in with the shade Smolder and I'm using a cornered brush. As you guys can see, it's slightly slanted to the side. This brush is from Miss Cosmetics. I'm not sure what number it is because it doesn't say it on the brush. But this is a very, very nice smooth brush and I've had it for a long time. So I'm going to link down below their website and see if I can find it so that I can show you guys which one it is. Once you've applied most of the product on that area with whatever is left over, just buff it out towards the top, but do not go above your crease. Next, I'm using the shade Smoked Out, and I'm going to be using a pencil brush also from Miss Cosmetics. So we're just going to be applying this as if it were eyeliner. Just go back and forth till you create a wing effect as if it were your normal eyeliner, except it's going to look smoky which makes it look so nice and so classic, which is perfect for New Year's Eve. Now for the next step, we're going to carefully be removing that piece of tape and you guys can see the results. But we're not finished yet. We're going to be going in with the NYX gel liner and I'm going to be applying this with a small eyeliner brush and I'm only going to draw a straight line on my lash line. I'm not going to create a wing because we're going back in with that black shade and we're going to buff that eyeliner out on the outer corner, if that makes any sense. Our goal is to blend that eyeliner together with the black shadow so that we get that smoky effect. So for this look, I want my eyeliner to be very dark. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be going in with my liquid liner from Italia Deluxe. And I'm only going to be applying it exactly where I applied the other eyeliner. And I'm going to stop at the center of my eye because I don't want to mess up the effect we just created with the wing. Now I'm going in with my Believe Beauty Concealer. And I'm going to be applying this on my under eye. And I'm also going to be showing you how to clean out that area where we applied the tape. So we're just lightly going to bring this upwards so that it gives us a sharper edge. And it looks really smooth and clean. Here's an up close look so you guys can see what it looks like. Next, I'm going in with my InStylish sponge and I'm just going to smoothen that concealer out. 
Now I'm just going in with a clean brush to clean out any extra makeup that might have landed on my brow bone. Now I'm going in with the shade Domination again and I'm going to be applying this on my lower lash line. I'm using that same brush that I used before. It was the M433. Now I'm going back in with that black shade and I'm using the Miss Cosmetics pencil brush again. Be careful when you're applying this black eyeshadow you guys. Try to keep this tightly onto your lash line so that we don't make a mess. Next I'm going to be applying some gel eyeliner and I'm going to be applying this on my lash line. Then I'm going in with that pencil brush again and I'm just going to blend this out really really good so that it creates that smoky effect mixed with that eyeshadow. Now going in with an eyeliner, this is a pencil eyeliner from Italia Deluxe. I'm going to be using this on my waterline to give it a more dramatic effect. Now I'm using the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, which is my ultimate favorite. I'm only going to be applying a couple of coats on my top lashes and bottom lashes because we're going to be applying these fake lashes from Lash Couture Fox Mink Collection Lashes. And you guys, these are super pretty and affordable. Just look at that. And this was the final step, you guys. Don't forget to click the subscribe button and hit that big notification bell and thumbs up. And I'll see you guys on my next video.